You're listening to the Cyberwire Network, powered by N2K. Hey, everybody, I want to take a few minutes here and talk about our sponsor, Splunk. You know, you need to keep operations humming around the clock, but potential disruptions are everywhere. Splunk helps you predict problems and find and fix issues fast so you can reduce risk and ditch downtime. The world's largest enterprises rely on Splunk's unified security and observability platform to become more efficient, resilient, and innovative. With Splunk, you can react quickly, evolve faster, and be ready for anything. Stay ahead of disruptions. Learn more at Splunk.com slash resilience. The word is bomb. Spelled B as in badass Alan Turing, O as in OPSEC, M as in man in the middle, B as in Bletchley Park, and E as in Enigma. Definition. A bomb is an electromechanical device used to break Enigma enciphered messages about enemy military operations during the Second World War. Example sentence. Alan Turing improved the obsolete Polish bomb decryption machine by discovering a design flaw in the Enigma encryption device. Origin and history. The first bomb, named Victory and designed by Alan Turing and Gordon Welchman, started code breaking at Bletchley Park on 14 March 1940, a year after World War II began. By the end of the war, five years later, Almost 2,000, mostly women, sailors, and airmen, operated 211 bomb machines in the effort. The Allies essentially knew what the German forces were going to do before the German commanders in the field knew. Historians speculate that the operation at Bletchley Park shortened the war by years and estimate the number of lives saved to be between 14 and 21 million. In the imitation game movie that debuted in 2014, Alan Turing, played by Benedict Cumberbatch, leads a diverse team to build the bomb, defines what artificial intelligence is, and events information theory. The movie returns three times to this inspirational quote. Sometimes it is the very people that no one imagines anything of who do the things that no one can imagine. 